Stop 15. Holyrood Palace. During the North Berwick witchcraft panic of 1590-92, some of the interrogations of suspects were carried out in Holyrood Palace. Holyrood was the principal royal residence and also the venue for Privy Council meetings. King James VI himself took part in some of these interrogations and even claimed personal credit for having discovered the accused witch's guilt. In a speech on 7th June 1591, he boasted, And for these witches, whatsoever hath been gotten from them hath been done by me, myself. The most important suspect to be interrogated at Holyrood Palace was Agnes Sampson, a wise wife and healer from Netherkeith in East Lothian. When she was first brought before the king and his counsellors, she refused to confess to witchcraft. They ordered her to be taken away and tortured, probably in the old toll booth. There, a rope was placed round her head and twisted tightly to cause pain. She also had all her body hair shaved off and was searched for the devil's mark. She was told that a mark had been found on her genitals. Broken by this treatment, she was brought back to the palace where she confessed to everything that she was asked. Agnes was tried, convicted and executed by strangling and burning at Castle Hill on 28th January 1591.